50 past the hour. Time for Make Ahead Monday. <laughs> Chef Curtis Stone joining us live. He's going to cook for us in a moment, but first, he's sharing something special his wife, Lindsay Price, is doing. Beautiful couple inside and out. She created a collection of sweatshirts to benefit Heart of Dinner, a New York City nonprofit that provides Asian elders with hot meals and letters of love. Curtis, good morning. Oh, good morning, nice. Curtis. How are you guys? Nice to see you all. You nice too. to see you. We heard Lindsay's a little under the weather, but you're here to she tell us all about one. her fabulous sweatshirts. Yeah, thank you so much. She got up this morning. Every time she went to speak, she went into a coughing fit. I said, that's not a good look Ooh, these days, yeah. babe. So um, I, I came in on my own, but she's doing fine, and she sends her love. So I'm here to talk a little bit about what she's done. She's done a collaboration on this sweatshirt that I'm wearing right now, Speak Up, Speak Out. Um, and 100% of the um, the proceeds go to part of the dinner. Now, what it's all about, of, of course, is the AAPI community went through such a hard time through the pandemic and, of course, with all the hate crimes. So this is just a way to sort of share within the AAPI community that it's a good thing to talk up and it's a good thing to be proud of your culture mm. because we love their culture, don't we? In America, we celebrate absolutely everyone and at least we, should, we absolutely should. So... Um, that always um, cultures together, from my perspective, is food. Um, and to me, there's no better cuisine than the Asian cuisine. And, of course, that's super broad. But I'm going to make a little dish this morning to celebrate um, all, all Asian people within America. Um, it's lemongrass. Oh, I've got my little marinade right here. I've actually got ginger, garlic, shallots and chilli. Um, there's some lemongrass and lime leaf as well. You dump everything into a food processor. Mm -hmm. So I've got a little mini food processor here I'm going to dump in my... Uh, roots, which give you all the flavour, and then the leaves. I've got my lemongrass and some lime leaf here as well. Mm. And then some coriander seeds, some uh, soy sauce, and a little bit of peanut oil. Now, you can use any kind of neutral flavoured oil, but you get all that in. And then this is effectively a wet marinade. So you let it turn. It takes literally just two or three seconds like that. I cheated and made one ahead of time. You dump that marinade straight over some chicken thighs mm -hmm. and we mix all of that together. I know you like a good stir fry, Al. What do you think, mate? I'm loving this so far. And you were just talking, Al, about chicken thighs. And I was. I, ch chicken thighs are my favorite cut of the chicken. It really is. It's moist and juicy. Then what you do is you skewer these little chicken mm -hmm. skewers. This is a great dinner that you guys can make um, ahead of time. It really is wonderful. So you turn those beautiful chicken thighs over. And then I'm actually doing like a bit of a bowl. These, these have become very, very popular. So in a rice cooker, okay. I've got my little mini multi cooker here. I'm going to take some of that beautiful rice. Just break that up in the center. Okay, in the mm. center of your bowl. So it's like one of those delicious superfood bowls. And then whatever veggies you like. I've got a few greens, mm -hmm. not too many greens, and then some veggies. I've got cucumbers. Mm. I've got some radishes. I've got some carrot. Mm. And then I've got some, uh, some beautiful heirloom carrots. Take your skewers, okay? And I'm just going to slide these out. Let me grab a plate. Just Curtis, like if this. If you don't eat chicken, if you don't eat poultry, yeah. could you do tofu with this? You sure could, um, Jill, my darling. You could do tofu, you could use shrimp, you could oh, use all good. sorts of protein. Absolutely, um, uh, so many different ways that you can take it. So I dropped my chicken there, a little bit of those fresh herbs. I've got some cilantro, some mint, some sesame. Oh, that marinade is um, good. Yeah. Isn't that delicious? Uh -huh. And it's very, very simple and easy. That's, that's what I love. You know, mm. when you're creating food, another thing that you can do, I've actually done a little fried rice here. Oh. And this is the leftovers because... You should never have anything that goes to waste. That's right. a very important um, part of food. And, of course, within the Asian community, there are so many wonderful dishes. And, you know, my mother-in-law, I saw her through those hate crimes being nervous to go to the Korean market. And I was mm -hmm. like, no, we've all got to speak up. We've all got to shout out mm -hmm. um, for our fellow um, fellow people. And, and it's... Uh, it's it's you know we all love Asian food, but that's not all that we should love about the Absolutely. Asian culture. Hey Curtis, how do so, if people want to support this movement and and maybe get the sweatshirt? How do you do it? Yeah, well, this is what I was going to rely on Lindsay for when she got here. <laughs> <laughs> if you go to her Instagram, I know that there's a link on okay. her Instagram. Okay, we'll, 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 we'll put it on our website. We'll do it for you, Curtis. We'll do, okay. And we'll put Thank it on today.com. We as got well. it. Thank you so much, and we hope she feels better. <laughs> and for these recipes and more information, Curtis, we got you on Speak Up, Thank Speak you. Out collection. Head to today.com/slash food.
Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.